It's a case Tucson police have had on the books for 30 years. The disappearance of 12 year old Jimmy Hendrickson. He went missing from a home near Prince and Stone on June 12th, 1991. And in tonight's Digging Deeper report, News 4 Tucson's Lupita Murillo spoke with family members and the first detective on the case almost three decades ago. Tucson police first listed this case as a runaway. It was assigned to a detective a year later. The detective tells me that when he got the case, he focused on the last person to see Jimmy Henriksen. When his mother and sister last saw Jimmy, they never realized it would be the last. The last time I saw Jimmy was waving out of the back of a stupid car. It's not fair. He wasn't a runaway. Tammy Tacho was just 17 years old. She said she and her mom went out of town. Jimmy chose not to go and stayed with a babysitter, a babysitter who let him spend the night at her cousin's house along with a four-year-old nephew. She shouldn't have gave my child to somebody else. Deborah Tacho says not a day goes by she doesn't miss her son. I love him. Oh, he's dead. Miranda Police Chief Ruben Nunez was the detective who worked the case. It's one of those cases that has just haunted me over these 30 years. He says he came up with a timeline focused on the babysitter's relative who became a person of interest. I actually met him uh, the night prior to Jimmy's disappearance. Um, and then I just focused on that individual. According to Chief Nunez, that person had a checkered past. He had a, um, a sexual deviancy uh, allegation uh, lodged against him uh, several years prior. That person had a warrant on an unrelated case and was questioned. I asked him if he was willing to take a, a polygraph test. He said he, he would. He took the test. He failed it. Nunez also questioned an acquaintance who was with the person of interest. He wasn't being truthful either. Also with Jimmy that night in care of the person of interest, a four-year-old boy who told Nunez he could show him where Jimmy was at. He's in Mexico. And I said, what? He says, yeah, Jimmy's in Mexico. Two bad men came in, wrapped him up in a blanket, and took him out, and he's in Mexico. The boy with the parents' consent took Nunez and another detective to the sports park. They pulled into the parking lot. The boy tells them. Keep going, and he leads us right to the Santa Cruz River, which adjoins the sports park. So he says, over there, that's where Mexico is at. Nunez says they searched the area and found nothing. Jimmy's sister is certain that person of interest knows something. And I just want a family member to come forward. And it would be so nice to be able to bring some peace to the family. So the family gathers in a circle like they do every year and pray. In Jesus' name, amen. Oh, it's going to get stuck. Even though it's been three decades, Tucson police say they're not giving up. This case is still being investigated. Digging deeper from the Tucson police headquarters, Lupita Murillo, News for Tucson.